Hey, what's up? So I think I have found the best Android emulator for Windows PC because it is based on Android 11. Yes, before this, I was using BlueStacks because it is the most popular and good Android emulator. But when I found out that there is an Android emulator which runs Android 11, I was like, OK, let's try this out. And I tried it. I'm really impressed and very happy <laughs> to use this Android emulator. So this Android emulator name is Mumu Player. So yeah, it's it's really good actually because this is the only Android emulator which is based on Android 11. This is the most up-to-date Android version you can get on any Android emulator. Honestly, this is my first time using this Android emulator. Yeah, <laughs> I'm really impressed, especially because it runs Android 11, so it has to be the best. Okay, <laughs> so maybe some of you guys are thinking, who made this? We don't know what not. So this Android emulator is actually made by a company called NetEase. So you can Google it or you can see right here. It's a huge company based on China. So now let's just talk about the uh, emulator itself so i went to the about device you can see it is based on android 11 really impressed there is no other android emulator which is based on android 11 forget about android 11 there is no android 10 yeah this is the only android emulator which uh, gives you the latest most up-to-date android version simply impressive okay <laughs> it's it, it feels so smooth so fast because it's Android 11, all right? So I have downloaded uh, two games, uh, Hill Climb, one of my favorite game, and PUBG, uh, which is like one of the most popular and heavy game to play on a phone or play on a Android. So I'm just gonna test them out. Uh, first, let's just talk about uh, the emulator itself. It's pretty good, feels very fast, okay? Uh, there is a settings which is very simple actually not too many options to confuse you so there is the basic settings there is the advanced settings you can change uh, the cpu ram and everything here interface you can change the resolution i have set it to default large you can set custom if you want to and there are other settings too there is a properties you can change the phone model and whatnot there is a game settings you can enable the h fr extra fps if you want to get like 120 fps and whatnot so yeah pretty simple basic not confusing settings i really like that and uh, now let's run pubg mobile let's play it okay there is everything key mapping and whatnot so the company who made this is actually really big so they are actually trying to you know make their product the best okay <laughs> uh, they already made it they already impressed me because i mean as i said this is the android 11 android emulator so simply this is just way better than any other android emulators so i'm just gonna play guest because i don't really play pubg uh, this is just for the test because you know <laughs> we need to test okay so i'm gonna go full screen i'm gonna do training because i'm a noob okay i don't want to ruin other people's game by joining you know multiplayer so it's just good to do some training so there is a key mapping already uh, available and you can see all of it and uh, you know if you have used a android emulator or you use android emulator you know how to use them almost all the android emulators have same type of controls over key mapping okay so yeah there is a lock now i can use my mouse looks like i'm i'm playing on a high sensitivity okay give me the gun brother give me give me that oh Oh, wait, wait, wait. I need to unlock the... Uh, I <laughs> As I told you guys, I am absolutely bad at this game. Okay, I never played this game. I played it. It's not like I never played it, but you know, uh, I'm really old man who doesn't know how to play this game. Okay, arrow key. How? 
I okay. <laughs> I don't know how to use all those controls either. I'm so bad. It's telling me to do something here, but uh, I'll do it. I'll use my mouse. Okay, never mind. Okay, you can see the game is running absolutely amazingly. Okay, you can improve the graphics and whatnot by going in game settings and you know emulator settings. So yeah, amazing. I'm gonna close this game because I don't want to play this game. <laughs> but you know, I did the test. It runs well. So yeah. So this is my favorite game. You know, whenever I test the Android emulators, I play this game. And I need to play this game. Okay. It's not a heavy game, you know, just, just for the demo. So I shouldn't be playing this because I already did, did the demo. All right. It just runs. Okay. You can see. So I'm going to close this out. Let's just talk about the other stuff. Okay. So this is the home page. Okay. Just like you expect from the Android emulators. Okay. And uh, there is a Google Play Store. Yes. And you can download all the games, applications, and whatnot compatible with Android 11. Yeah, up to Android 11. If there is a uh, game or application which requires you to have a Android 11, got it, because you're running Android 11 emulator. So I think I don't need to talk too much. That's it. Hope you enjoyed it. <laughs> Let me give you guys one more interesting info. Uh, you know, there is a android subsystem for windows 11 that is also based on android 11 but android 11 on windows 11 absolutely sucks because there is no play store and you can't really game on it and most of the applications doesn't even work on that so uh, better to use android emulator it's it's really impressive actually i i and I don't know what to say. Okay, this is the most up-to-date Android uh, emulator that you can get. And yeah, that's it. I'm not gonna talk too much. Hope you enjoyed it. And I will put link in the description for the official website for this Android emulator. You can go there and download the uh, latest Android 11 beta. As of now, it's in beta, but feels like it's in a stable version. That's it. I'm not going to talk too much. <laughs> I will see you in the next one. Take care of yourself and have fun. Bye-bye.